செய்திகள் ஸ்பான்சர்ட் பை எம்பசி கம்யூனிகேஷன் எம் கே பி நகர் சென்னை கோ ஸ்பான்சர்ட் பை இந்து டெய்லர்ஸ் வடபழனி சென்னை பவர்ட் பை ஜி கே கிராபிக்ஸ் வடபழனி சென்னை TV and I'm Pauline Jaya Subha bringing you the news. Let's look at the headlines. Merkel says time is running out for Greece deal. Seven dead in South Korea MERS outbreak. Twelve Naxals shot down by police in Palamu district. Surya Namaskar out of yoga day drill after Muslim protests. India refuses entry to Greenpeace International staff. Let's look at the news in brief. German Chancellor Angela Merkel has warned that time is running out for a deal to keep Greece in the Eurozone. Speaking after the G7 summit in Germany, she said Europe would show solidarity but only if Greece makes proposals and implements reforms. Earlier Greek finance minister Yanis Varoufakis said it was time to stop finger pointing and find an agreement. Other topics on the agenda at the G7 summit were climate change, countering extremism and the war in Ukraine. A seventh person has died in South Korea after contracting Middle East Respiratory Syndrome MERS, health ministry said. The patient was a 68-year-old woman with a pre-existing heart condition who was infected at the same hospital as all the other victims so far. Eight new cases were confirmed on Tuesday, a significant drop from the 23 new cases reported on Monday. It is now the biggest outbreak outside the Middle East with 95 infections. Hong Kong said it would issue a red alert against non-essential travel to South Korea. A red alert means there is deemed to be a significant threat to those travelling to a country. In a major gun battle in Jorkan, on late Monday night, security forces killed at least 12 Naxals in Palamo district. The operation was jointly conducted by the Central Reserve Police Force and the Jorkan Police at Bakoria of Satbarba area. Eight weapons were recovered from the spot. This is the first major incident in Jakin after Maoists had ambushed a police vehicle in Dhamka on April 20, 2014 when the police party were returning after completion of the third phase of Lok Sabha elections. Eight persons including six policemen were killed by the Maoists in that incident. The centre has decided to stop Surya Namaskar from Asanas to be performed by people across the country to commemorate International Day of Yoga on June 21. The trimming of the drill is aimed at catering to the sensibilities of the minorities in the wake of opposition from Muslim groups. Launching a nationwide campaign against making what a dub Hindu religious practices compulsory in educational institutions, the All India Muslim Personal Broad had demanded that the order making Surya Namaskar compulsory in schools be also cancelled. A staff member of global campaign group Greenpeace has been prevented from entering India and sent back to Australia, the group has alleged. Our own Green Block was refused entry on Saturday night despite having a valid business visa and all necessary documents, the group said. It added that no formal reason was given by immigration officials and he was not officially deported. A senior government spokesman said officials were looking into the matter. Greenpeace said Arun Grey Block was on his way to meetings in India when immigration officials stopped him at Bangalore airport on Saturday night and put him on a flight to Kuala Lumpur without explanation. That's all for the news. Keep watching MudalSaidi.tv செய்திகள் ஸ்பான்சர்ட் பை எம்பசி கம்யூனிகேஷன் எம் கே பி நகர் சென்னை கோ ஸ்பான்சர்ட் பை இந்து டெய்லர்ஸ் வடபழனி சென்னை பவர்ட் பை ஜி கே கிராபிக்ஸ் வடபழனி சென்னை